Welcome to John's Metal Detecting Adventures. Here we are on Bowdland looking for history. Please join me and see what we can find. In these fields, they've been finding Roman medieval artifacts. It's all been ploughed and seeded. Let's enjoy it. Ploughed there, can't touch it just yet. Have to wait till it's battled. Here we go. Oh, Carlton just come up with a signal. We're on top, wasn't it, Carlton? What have you got there, lad? It's a uh, roach from. Uh... So look, see what it is. Put it in front of the camera. Oh no, it's a buckle of 16th, oh, 16th buckle. century. That's what it is. A buckle, bronze. Oh, very nice, that mate. That's all right, isn't it? What? With his simplex. He found that with his simplex. Cracking on top. He says. Oh, potentially here, yeah, potentially here, yeah. crack it. 20, 20 that. Oh. Oh, there you go. Oh, spindle whirl. I think that's Roman because they're playing. Roman ones are generally playing. Roman, Roman spindle whirl, I think. I think that's what that is. Not sure what that is green so I don't think it's silver <laughs> in here it's in there whatever it is ah oh, oh what's that Roman coins, bronze. I've uh, got this sod out here and it's uh, 17, 18. Oh. It's a large uh, 17th century button. No pattern. I think it's silver plated. Silver plated that. Uh -huh. 20 on the top. Got a coin. Quite sure of the date, but right down 1920s. Up, Penny George V. There you go. Little spindle whirl there. I think it's the spindle whirl. It's an hole in it. It's a small little spindle whirl. So I'm not quite sure about the age. 17. Out of that all, with a cloth seal. You usually have lettering cloth seals for trading in the, in the uh, 16th, 17th, or even 18th century. But it's a cloth seal. I'm cleaning it up and uh, let's see what information can come up with it. Cloth seal, lead. 17, straight away. Oh, I think I can see it. Hang on, hang on, mate. Oh, what's this? Hang on, what's this? Uh, oh, hey! Is this armoured? It's armoured! I got armoured! Holy shit! Which is it? What is it? I think it, might, it's, it looks like Elizabeth to me, Elizabeth. 
Oh man, that's okay. It's just a bit missing on the bottom there, but Ahmed, I got Ahmed today. Hey, cracking Ahmed. I'm pleased with that. Superb. Brilliant. I come up with Ahmed. Absolutely superb. I'm, I'm real happy today. It's Ahmed. Elizabeth the first. 1579. Half growth. That's made my day. Have a look at that. Superb. Hammered. I'll let you the other side. Happy with that. Let me find another. I don't know. Carry on hunting. Teen. Pistol shirt. I have a pistol, 16th, 17th century pistol shirt. You certainly won't like that in here. There's no doubt about it. Well, out of this old, it's uh, 15, uh, and I reckon that's a Roman grot, that. Roman there. Uh, can't make it out, so when I get back to headquarters, we'll try to see if we can find out any information on it. But uh, that's Roman. Roman, small little bronze. But not much information on it, I'm afraid. And that were 15 on my machine. So... Ah. Yeah. We do with a nice one so we can have some nice pattern. Let's see what's on here. So, uh, Carlton's come up with something today. He's got us, uh, I think, I think a token of some kind. Uh, not sure until we investigate the, uh, the lettering, but it's a copper coin token. Not quite sure who and when. Maybe you can see it on the uh, GoPro, but we can't. I'll spin it round. Um, but it's investigation time. See that? Part of a thimble. Thimble. It could be medieval. Thimble. It's not silver though. Thimble at 16. I got my head torch on, but anyway, we've uh, so far we've got another uh, spindle whirl here. Another spindle whirl. Not fancy though. Thank you. 